One of PowerPoint 2010's new features is the ability to add equations to your presentation. Users of Microsoft Word for the last decade have been able to do this, but those people using PowerPoint, professors especially of physics, any kind of science, have found it very difficult to add equations to their slideshow. With PowerPoint 2010, the same tools that are available in Microsoft Word are now available in PowerPoint. To demonstrate, we're going to add a new slide to our presentation. After we've shown our audience how they can come and see us in person or take a virtual tour online, we're going to add a new slide to show our audience the secret formula that we use for production. We'll change the layout. And through the Insert tab, on the far right, we'll pull down Equation. You'll see that PowerPoint comes with a number of equations already built in, such as the Pythagorean Theorem, the Quadratic Formula, and more. If I want to add one of these to my existing presentation, I just give it a click. And there's the Binomial Theorem. But if I want to create one from scratch, I'll use the Insert tab and click on the equation icon. As you can see, a text box appears where I can type my equation. You'll also note that the Equation Tools Design tab has appeared on the top of the ribbon, allowing me great control over the formatting and a variety of symbols that I want to include into my equation. And as you can see, adding an equation is very simple to do using pull down menus, selecting text, selecting text pulling down menus, and adding more information. Just as you'd expect, you can also copy and paste, and you'll see how PowerPoint automatically adjusts the formula text box based on what you've typed. Just like any other text box, after you've created your equation, you can select the text and either right-click or return to the Home tab and increase the size, reposition it, rotate it, and use any of the other available tools that PowerPoint has to change the look of your text. So finally, a feature that's been available in Word and Excel is now here in PowerPoint for us to enjoy.